Hello and welcome to Quick Tips, the WooCommerce video series. In this video, I'm going to install Affiliate for WooCommerce plugin to start an affiliate program on your own website. If you are running an e-commerce website, then you can allow people to start selling your product on their website. They can register as an affiliate user and they will start promoting your products on their website, on their blog, on their YouTube channels. And when they sell any product, they will get an affiliate commission. The name of the plugin is Affiliate for WooCommerce. This is the official plugin on the WooCommerce website. So in this video, I'm going to install this plugin and I'll show you how to customize this plugin, how the plugin works and how you can start an affiliate program on your own website. So let's see how does this work. So here I'm logged into the dashboard of the WordPress website and we are using WooCommerce on this website. Now I'm going to install the Affiliate for WooCommerce plugin. Let me show you the website. This is the plugin affiliate for WooCommerce and it is available on the official WooCommerce website. I'll give you the link in the description box if you want to buy this plugin. Here is the pricing of this plugin $14.92 per month and if you buy it annually it will cost you $179. You will get one year extension updates, one year technical support and 30 days money back guarantee is also available. So these are the features of this plugin. Powerful affiliate program with full control and accuracy. Here you will see some screenshots, how the dashboard will look. You can create campaigns as well as you can create different types of commission plans. All right, so let's go back to the dashboard. Go to plugins and click on add new. Click on upload plugin. So I have this plugin downloaded, so I'm going to install it now. Click on activate plugin. All right, so the plugin is installed and you will see this message here. If you want to learn how this works, you can follow these links. To get started, you need to go to settings. So click on these settings. So here, if you go to WooCommerce, then settings, you will see a new tab added here that is affiliate. All right, so here you will see the registration form. So you need to put a registration form on your website so that people will be able to apply for the affiliate program. This is the short code for the affiliate form. Let me show you the form. If you want to edit the form, you can edit the form. This is how the form will look. And here you will see the option to edit the form. Email, first name, last name, website, password, confirm password. So if you do not want this field, you can simply uncheck it. All right, so I'm not going to make any changes here. So this is how the form will look and this is the short code. Let me install this form on one of the pages. So I have one demo page. I'm going to install this form on the demo page. So here I'm going to add a short code. And this is how the form will look. All right, let's go back to the dashboard. Here you will see approval method. If you want the affiliate applications to be approved automatically, you can simply check this box and it will get approved automatically. So there is no need to review the application manually. If you check this box, all the applications will be approved automatically. User, affiliate user roles. So here you can see the, you can set the option. So what user role you want to assign for the affiliate so i'm going to use it as a subscriber let's make it as a referral commission so here you can set up the store wide default commission so here you will see two different options percentage and flat amount so i'm going to set up 20 percent so all the affiliate users will start getting commission of 20 percent for each sale if you want to add tiers, you can add the tiers also. So I'm going to save this option. So we have got one plan. If you want to add another plan, you can simply click on this add a plan. You can add another range of commission. And you, here you will see different condition when all the conditions group pass. So you need to set up the condition when you want to assign 30% commission for each affiliate. All right, so I'm not going to use it. So I'm going to keep 20% flat commission rate. 
let's go back here if you want to exclude product you can exclude the product from here affiliate tags you can manage the affiliate tags this is the tracking name let's see this is how the referral id will look at the end of each link you will see this tracking code added to the link such as question mark ref is equal to and the id of the user so this link can be used by the affiliate user to promote your products if you want to change you can change that but i'm going to keep it as it is personalized affiliate identifier so you can use that instead of this link you can set another friendly links if you want to use coupons for referrals you can use that also cookie duration grade is the first or last affiliate so you can set the last affiliate so the last link that the user has used to buy the purchase will get the affiliate commission lifetime commission you can allow the affiliates to receive the lifetime commission on such affiliate self referral so you can allow the affiliate to earn commission on their own orders so if i'm affiliate user then i can also get commission whenever i purchase the product from your website affiliate manager email send referral details to admin and how do you want to make payment paypal email address allow affiliates to enter their paypal email address from my account so this disabling this will not show paypal email address so let's enable this so you will be able to make payments using PayPal. So you can set up automatic payment system using PayPal for the affiliate users. To enable follow the requirements, you need to follow these requirements to enable the payout using PayPal. How to pay out? Here you will see the information how you can set up the automatic payment using PayPal. So I'm going to save the changes here. Right, and here you can see we have 20% commission plan. If you want to run campaigns, you can also run campaigns. Here you can see different campaigns are already created in draft. So these affiliate users can use these campaigns. So you can give them the information about the campaign and then they can run the campaign for your products. You can simply activate and save it. You can make changes to the campaign. The user will be able to see the campaigns also. Let's go to dashboard here. Right now there are no affiliates, so it's not going to show any affiliates here. Now I'm going to log in as a user and let's see how this looks on the user dashboard. So here in the another browser, I'm going to log in as a user. Here I'm logged in and here I can see a form is already there, register as an affiliate. So I can register as an affiliate. So I'm going to register here. So I'm going to submit the form. All right, so we have received your request and the form is under review now. Let me show you the form, actual form here. You can create a page and you can show the affiliate form on the page also. Okay, so here it says your request is in moderation. So let's go back to the admin dashboard here and refresh it. Now here you will see one application is under review. So I can go here. So this is the first user who has applied for the affiliate program. And you will see all the details of the user here. All right, so I'm going to approve this one now. So the admin has accepted your program. Let's refresh it. And here you can see the details of this particular user. How many referrals, how many payouts. So let's go back to the customer end, refresh it. And here you can see that you have you are already registered as an affiliate. Let's go back to my account. And here you will see the affiliate option. So I'm the approved affiliate user. Let's go to affiliate. And this is how the dashboard for the user will look. So I can go to profile. Here you will see profile of the user. This is the link. You can request for a coupon. Referral generator. Okay, if I want to 
create a link i can let's go to any one of the products and let's see if we can create a link let's see i want to sell this program or sell this product and you can see the referral link is ready so i can use this link to promote this product whenever someone make any purchase using this referral link i can get the affiliate commission here you will see the paypal email settings i will be able to enter the paypal email address here let's go to campaigns here okay so here you can see one campaign is active so the affiliate user can use this campaign they can use these banners so you can give them some campaign material and they will be able to promote your products using this campaign let's close this let's go to uh, this link and now i'm going to make a purchase using this referral link so i'm going to shop let's make a purchase of this product price of this product is 1000 okay i have placed the order now let's go back to the dashboard of the admin and go to orders here you will see the order let's make it as complete all right so this order is marked as completed let's go back to the dashboard of the affiliate program We are logged in as the admin and here you can see that one visitor using the referral link one customer 100% conversion product worth 1000 rupees and gross commission 200 rupees so that the 20% net commission so this is the user 200 rupees has been earned by this user so this is the dashboard of the admin now let's go back to the user the affiliate user dashboard and refresh it affiliate now here you will see that gross commission for the user is 200 rupees one visitor and one visitor has made a purchase and you have got the commission of 200 rupees this is the total sales and the admin can also have the full control over the affiliate program so this is how you can use this affiliate for woocommerce plugin and start your own affiliate program on your own website so that's it for now see you in the next video do not forget to subscribe to my channel to get more quick tips about online softwares and tools if you have any questions please leave us message in comment section and press the like button if you like the video thanks for watching quick tips